It is for me a tremendous privilege to have been asked to lay some flowers this afternoon and it indeed, indeed is for me a tremendous honour that this part of Leicester should fall in my own Leicester South constituency and I just want to take a moment to congratulate Peter and all the councillors back 20 odd years ago who took the decision to commemorate this park to Nelson Mandela. But today is about honouring a man who, as we have just heard, was an ordinary man who achieved extraordinary things. In the face of vicious inequality, he took a stance for equality. In the face of vicious injustice, he took a stance for justice. And then when eventually he was freed, and we all around the world celebrated that moment, a country that potentially would have been riven, which could have fallen to pieces. He taught and he preached forgiveness and he brought that country together. He scaled a mountain which for many of us thought could never be scaled, becoming the president of that country that for most of our lifetime had been riven by an evil apartheid. But then when he stopped being president, he didn't give up. He remained an activist. Having scaled one mountain to defeat apartheid, he said, I'm going to scale another mountain. And he led the global campaign against AIDS and HIV. And the best commemoration for Nelson Mandela, more than flowers and placards and flags which we are rightly waving and laying today, the greatest commemoration to Nelson Mandela will be to rid the world of the scourge of AIDS and HIV in Africa and across the developing world. But, but today is about remembering that great man, remembering his achievement, and indeed, and indeed, remembering the role that activists here in Leicester and across the United Kingdom played in campaigning and lobbying and marching for his freedom. So I want to thank everyone who's here, because many of you would have been on the, on the marches, I know. I was... I did my bit. I was at school, but I was doing my own small bit as a pupil. But today is about remembering that ordinary man who achieved extraordinary things. Rest in peace, Madiba.